Hello everybody and welcome back to more Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning. Now let's see what we can do about finding Mr. What's-His-Face. Now... Okay, well... This side... Right? Yes, this side. God. Seems to be a dead end, so let's check out the dead end first. Oh, never mind, it's not a dead end. What, 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 where? Damn. Don't make it too easy, guys. Done. Oh, so that's what's making the weird sounds. It's very pretty. I'm watching the flower because I'm wondering if it's one of those. Remember at the beginning of the video where it was like, these flowers only um, respond to whatever people blah blah blah. So I'm wondering if it's that kind of thing. And I wanted to see if it would close if I went away from it. So that would be a nice touch, but it, apparently it doesn't. Uh, which way should we go? Doesn't really matter. But uh... Jeez. Ah. Okay. I gotta say, I'm unlocking in this game is kind of easy. Not complaining though. Cripple spore caps and a hidden thing in rubbles. Ooh. I don't care about fine land. Is it better? No. Nothing is better than these chakrams, my god. So good. So glad I stole them. this fight without being here. Almost. Not quite. Ooh, I want... Now this is the problem with like going on and on with your shit because you start to run out of room. Oh! I didn't know I had this. Oh hell yeah. I'll equip it. So much better. I must have had that for so long. Do these take up inventory space as well? I'm not sure. Huh. I'm assuming they do. Don't I have anything that's like real crap? There's crude birch staff. I can get rid of that. Let's take the staff of skill. Oh jeez. I just don't have the room. Okay. 
Let's go find this dude. Do I have any daggers that are crap? Not really. Crude chainmail. Yeah, let's get rid of it. And normal steel gauntlets. Get rid of that too. Actual daggers sound like something that might fetch a fair price. Right. Nothing else. Let's go. Uh, which way should we go? Well, this way then. Oh, I can't jump down. What crap. I thought. Potions do take up space. Damn it. Well, that was sure hard. Shit. I would like a repair kit, actually. Crude iron track wings. Yes. Oops. Are you serious? Yes. Let's take the repair kit. Nothing in here. Um, the layout of this place, not exactly, but this room is um, actually exactly the same as one of the previous dungeons and I don't really blame them but they've done a good job in like redoing it because the last one was kind of more sparkly blue and stuff Oh, he's dead fuck I think I might get rid of some, um, actually, what about shit like this? Bones. Can I- Oh, it does. Where's the fucking s- Oh, I can't get rid of those because those are part of the quest. I can't get rid of that because that's a quest. I can get rid of this, though. Okay. Let's uh let's read. All right, the Journal of Stellan Creighton. 
Motus Mining will be astonished at these findings. So many reagents lie within these woods. The alchemical implications are enormous. Wild Fay pose quite the problem, though. It will take an exorbitant amount of manpower to subdue and control the beasts here. Still, the potency of the plant life here should make it worthwhile. The Fae themselves might be a problem, assuming the fabled city of... I have no idea how to pronounce that, even though I've heard it before. Yeast? Uh, actually exists. Haven't seen anything to indicate it's real. It wouldn't surprise me if the runes I keep finding are the only vestige of their rule. Overall, Dalentoth should make quite the profit for the company. Headquarters will be pleased. Wait, that's all? I thought you had, like, tons of information in there. What the hell is with this? Wait a minute. Uh-huh. Tattered journal. Day 7. Keska betrayed me. Thought the girl wanted that foolish cult destroyer, but it turns out she was just bait. Why can't I ever resist a pretty pair of legs? Damn fools keep chanting and smearing that foul-smelling sap all over their faces. Kanarok had hired me to kill this cult, but I've only become another tender morsel for its dark tree gone. Some bounty hunter I've turned out to be. They have others. People and creatures penned like cattle in cages. Think we're food, but for what? I need to get out of here. Day 11. Ceremony last n Ceremony last night. Or day? I can't tell. Everyone chanting, holding hands, something was killed, couldn't make out what from my cage. Screams sound like human, mostly. There was a thunderclap, I think, then every torch in the place went dark. Lots of screams. Wet sounds, smacks and swallows, smell of blood. Been quiet for a while, not sure what's happening. They forgot about me, I bet. She came near. I think it was her, Casca. Hair was white, though. Legs, too long. Her voice like teeth, scraping on bone. Her eyes are so bright. I think she's becoming something else. Something different. And I think she ate the others. Am I next? Oh god. Day 21. No sign, no food. Drinking sap that drinks from, drips from the dark above. Her voice is everywhere. She haunts in the cave, eating with thick, wet gulps. I think she forgot me. And my cage. I'm glad it's dark. Can't see. Don't want to see. Soon I'll be thin enough to fit through the bars and then I'll escape. Did you now? Nope, you just died. Damn. That's pretty fucking dark. Where is she though, Keska? <gasps> Wait a minute. Is Keska the one? Oh, never mind. I was actually thinking of this exact creature. I was like, was Keska the one that I killed before? Because the description that was in the journal fitted that monster perfectly, so I was like wondering if Keska was that person or that thing, but no, here she is. And uh, she doesn't have anything that I want to take. What about you though? No. Actually we might as well. Since we actually have the thing. By thing, I mean inventory space. Alright, let's just get out of here. And let's get to a merchant ASAP. I feel like Dragon Age all over again. I always did this in Dragon Age, where I always had full fucking... Um... Full inventory. Jeez. Can't even think of the word inventory. Hey, dumbass. Oops, wrong skill. There's a little hidden cache around here. Really? Whatever. You know what? No. It's a mana potion. I like mana potions. 
I'd rather get rid of that or that. Yeah, I'll get rid of this actually because I will never use poison. Or if not never, then very rarely. Let's take that. And let's hope that no one tries to give us anything in reward. Because, um... Yeah, I just can't take it right now. Run, run, running, running. Oh, I'm dumb. I was just following the gold circle blindly without even really looking at the map itself. That's always a smart thing to do. here. Good, good, good. Let's turn in all these fucking quests that we have. It should free up a lot of room in our inventory. Uh, where was the dude again? Where is he? My journal! Oh, I trust this wasn't too difficult to obtain. Uh, What's of Horace? <sighs> yeah, he's dead. A shame that. Thank you for being brave enough to retrieve this, in spite of what happened to Horace. As we agreed, here is some gold for your trouble. I appreciate your help. No problemo. Wow, that's a lot of gold. Jeez. Can I fast travel here? No? Really? Darn. Well, I guess we'll have to run there. Um, I'll probably speed this footage up. I mean... Well, you know what? I'll just fucking cut. Hey, I found a lower stone! Story of two valiant souls I bring. Of the Lords named Erema and Kreth I see. Two hearts united against common foes. The thoughts in mind of one, the other knows. Lord Kreth, a Fey Knight's most stoic and grave. Lord Erema's night hand and shadow, the brave. And genteel Erema, his equal in might. Dawn to Kreth's dust. Stay alert. To this night. Here's the tale of how they stopped a troll. The maid of Windermere misled its soul. All right, Mr. Declan Mellis. Well done, friend. Well done indeed. I know in time the Ooh. trolls will return. But at least now I can make it back to Shieldring Keep with my head held high. Here, take this. It was Jewelry's sword. Broken now, but she might be mighty again if a skilled smith wants to make her so. It's what Jewelry would have wanted. Right. I was unable to complete the contract, but since you have, you best get your own eye back to Shieldring Keep and turn it in. Off with you then. Yes, sir. Goodbye. Farewell. Um, right, that's what I wanted. Alright, let's go back to... Oops, that's what I wanted. Here, Canarock.
Come for Jennery, what's needed? Hello. So, the savior comes for Cartery. What do you want? I found this dagger at Toho Farm. You... you did? I, I must have left it behind when I was fleeing those spiders. The damn things were everywhere. I can see you're not convinced. So that Toph brat sent you to oh, do a little tough. digging. It was only a matter of time before she learned what I did to her parents. But why? But you found out first. A stroke of luck. Now, let's come to an arrangement, shall we? Say, a heavy purse for your silence? Why did you kill them? Carowin and I fought at the gates of Mel Senshir years ago. We deserted before we saw our second battle. When we came here, she invited me to join her and her husband Imer and their daughter on that farm. It was a simple life. I thanked the gods for it. Then Carowin and Imer decided to return to the war and bring me with them. When they insisted, I used the only skill war ever taught me. Why didn't you just tell them you didn't want to go back? I think he could have dealt with that better, and no deal, you're going to Really? Pay. The wandering hero is going to bring me to justice? I think not. You're going to pay I've murdered life. twice before, and you shall be my third. Do you know how many times Finally. I've murdered before? Obviously not. What is it? Is something wrong? Uh, you're not the person I want. Hello. I can't believe Carteret killed them. My mother and father had been his friends for years, before I was even born. To think that he did all this just to avoid the war. I knew my family was likely dead, but I thought it wouldn't be over something like this. Thank you for your help. Here, here is your reward, as promised. Thanks. Farewell. Ooh, silk farmer gloves. What is that? Probably something shitty, but... No, it's not shitty at all. But I can't wear it due to it being 14 finesse. Yeah. And... Let's put these bones to rest, shall we? It's not that way. It's uh, this way. Hello, stranger. I'm not a stranger. I just found the fucking mystery of your. What? Never mind. This ossuary looks as if it had seen better days. However, it would be a fitting place to rest the bones of the dead silk farmers you found in a webwood. There we go. Now I should have some more room in my inventory, yes? No. I see, so those bones actually didn't take up room in my inventory. Hmm. That's kind of good to hear. Yes, stranger? Uh... Which one's the inn again? That one, the one with the music blaring out of it. Oops. Uh... Shop person? You! I was wrong about you. It had been so long since we've had to rely on ourselves that I didn't want to trust a stranger. You have my thanks. All of our thanks, I'm sure. Alright. Not soon enough. Where is the woman who runs this place? You're not her. Is she outside? Seriously? She's always like wandering, not always, but she's often wandering around and it's kind of annoying. You're not her. I'm looking for someone, some girl, woman, 
His name starts with an S. Sil something. Why don't I just set my... Wait, why am I looking for her? Right, because I want to sell shit to her, not because I want to... Well, what is this place? Abandoned house. Have I been in here before? Maybe. No. Wow. Owner's journal. Hmm. Let's read it. Another day has gone past and the spiders have almost crossed the south bridge. Is this some kind of punishment for trying to profit off the web wood? If so, it's working. Half the town is rotting in the webs and the other half is growing mad with fear. Well, I've had enough of it. These fools can think it's safer to hide behind their bridges and their barricades. I know that there's only going to be one way off this island soon enough and that's going to be that's to be dragged by spiders but I'm not going to let that happen to me at first light tomorrow I'm striking north with any luck I'll be in eyeshot of the war sworn keep before the spiders even know I'm loose good luck with that I wonder what happened to him if he actually made it. Nothing, nothing, nothing. What is it? Not you, I don't want you. Where did that woman get to? I swear she's... That is not her. We've still a long ways ahead of us before the silken seat is back to what it was, but I've had Billis hard at work to make it so. Now, what is it that I can do for you? Oh, I can shop with her. Okay, whatever. Ooh. Mine's still better. Holy shit. Now... Hmm. Gold drops. Experience. Liquid seduction. Oh. What about... Okay. I thought maybe it's because it had an ambiguous name, that's why, but no. Why are they different? Hmm. Who the fuck knows? Yeah, I can't use the silk farmer's gloves. You know what, I might as well just sell the silky veal. I mean, it's taking up a thing, and I don't like to sell it, but I can't put it in my storage chest. So, I'm sorry. Ooh. I'll have to look at that a bit. Finesse. Finesse. 
this again. Steel gauntlets. Might 12. What is armor socket and utility socket? Oh, the different types. Okay. Never mind, but... God damn it. Why does like everything require might and finesse? What is this again? Bleeding damage. Hmm. I wonder if this stuff counts for inventory as well. I would guess that it does. Hmm. Beware the forest! I swear there was a woman here whose name was Sil something or something like that. And she ran this place. Unless I'm thinking of a different town? Oh, whatever. Where is this? Up there. Where are all these books anyways? They're like all over the place. Well, let's just go to Sheldrick's Keep. And I th think we'll go and turn these in next time, so I'll see you guys then.